How's it going, Shaq? Yeah, it's fine. Uh, yeah, it's fine. My spirits are low today. Uh, Why is that? No, I don't think there's any real reason. I think sometimes you wake up and your spirits are low. <laughs> or okay. sometimes you do a thing and then when you're done, you just kind of, you know, you're like, ugh. And it's not that it took a lot out of me or anything like that, but for whatever reason, at this point in time, my spirits are a little low. I'm sure I'll be, I'm sure I'll be fine tomorrow or I might need to eat something. You know, it could be any number of things, but okay. yeah. Uh-huh. How about you? I'm hoping How are you it doing? bounces back. Um, I, uh, weirdly, I, uh, I gotta tell you, I felt the opposite, uh, mm-hmm. like two days ago. Okay. I felt like extremely high in spirit. Uh-huh. Um, and uh, I got to give full credit to something I don't think I'd ever say. Uh, I felt significantly better after having a salad. <laughs> like I had a salad and I was like, oh, like this is what people talk about. Like, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. absolutely. Sure. Um, Real talk, my skin felt better. Uh-huh. My, like I, I felt like I felt like my blood was moving different inside of me. Like it was like, oh, OK, we got a little pick me up today. You know? Wow. OK, well, yes. Straight uh, I had a salad yesterday, um, and uh, I don't know if all of those things uh, happened for me instantaneously or anything, but uh, I was just like, oh, I'm, I'm glad I'm eating a salad. As you can see, <laughs> whatever happened, it did not last a full 24 hours because I am, ugh, I could just, yeah, I could just be uh, exhausted. Uh, who knows? Maybe I didn't get enough sleep, although I feel mm. like I did, or maybe there's a episode of law and order that i watched that's really weighing on me although i did just have one on um and the victim in that episode the character's name was michael jones and they just kept saying his name and i kept going <laughs> like who and and oh man and no one was here to respond to me. The cat, <laughs> the cat's too young to know Mike Jones. Um, oh, is that number still connected? I don't you know. know. I can't you remember. Know? What's the number? You remember, right? No, nah, I don't. But like, I oh, knew okay. it was like a thing. I know. Yeah, it was a, a legit number. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It might be still connected. I'd like I'd like to hope that he disconnected it. But also, what what else you got going on? Go on and answer yeah. the phone. Keep the you phone, know? you know. Especially yeah. now, the phone plans are better. Like you can finally like support the call, the calls. Like uh, back yeah. then, when he when he did that, that you were getting charged per call. You know, you were getting charged if you were getting called during like uh, the daytime. Oh, daytime, yes, daytime yeah. minutes versus nights and weekend minutes. Oh my Straight goodness. Up. He was getting crazy bills. Like right now, it's just a flat forty dollars. <laughs> That's true. Go crazy, you know That's what I mean? True, this is when you need it. Who wants to talk to Mike Jones? Yo, I talk out, to Mike Jones outside of you know uh, some old man or a creditor. I don't know. Maybe <laughs> maybe Paul Wall talks to him. Right? They were that yeah. was the same crew, right? Paul Wall's doing fine for himself. He's making yeah. grills and shit. Real Still, talk. Paul, Paul uh, expanded. Yeah, yeah, he really did. Good for him. He kept his brand strong. Yo, yeah, he really did. Up. And he still can rhyme. Yeah. Uh, I mean, he had a set rhythm. He had a way all of his rhymes sounded. Like, blah, 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 you see the blah blah blah. You see the blah blah blah. <laughs> you see the blah 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 blah. That's how. It- <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> they all went like that. That is not only based on uh, drive slow. I swear to you, all of the rhymes went like that. And I was oh, like, man. I heard, I heard that a few times, and I just went, all right, I'm good. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> You know, don't. What's that? What's that game called where like uh, people ask you to answer question and they fill it into like a pre-made, like what, uh, like uh, Mad Libs? Yeah, yo, yeah. Reese, Paul Wall <laughs> Mad Libs, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's kind of fire. You see them, right? You see that? <laughs> it all sounded like that. Bless his heart. <laughs> Uh, Shouts to Paul Wall. I'm a fan now. Real talk. I'm going to play all Paul Wall today. 
I mean, not. yeah, well, I mean, I, he may have switched it up, but I feel like no. And it's fine to have a template. Look, yeah, then you, you don't have it. to think. You know exactly how it's a smart way to write a rhyme. If you know, okay, I need a rhyme for this part. <laughs> I need, you know, A, B, A, B, <laughs> A, B, C, A, B, C. Like, you know, <laughs> you know what you're oh, doing. That's fantastic. Yeah. Oh man, real talk. Yo, Paul, I'm sorry for giving away your secrets. You know, <laughs> you gave away your secrets <laughs> by getting it down on wax. All I'm doing is observing. <laughs> oh my goodness, but uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, no one was there to enjoy the Mike Jones reference. Yeah. You know, you know. Uh, I will say I do appreciate there are Law and Order episodes that like. I, 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 they let the bad guy get away just enough that, uh-huh. like, I know, like, oh, like, this might not go how I think, you know? <laughs> right. Yes. You know, yeah. Like, they they do. do a good job of that. You wrote Yeah. Talk. Yeah. They, they really do, uh, lose a good amount of time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay>. yo. <laughs> I watched that show, like, yo, this is too much like real life. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like oh, my goodness. You know? Um, <laughs> Oh man, yeah. y'all supposed to be the stars and the hero, but nah, y- y'all lose a solid fifty percent of these episodes. You know? <laughs> right? Yes. <laughs> so it's kind of uh, it's kind of wild, but um, straight up, yeah. So I, uh, I I've just been kind of uh, uh, I guess I don't know. Just watching, I watch Original Recipe. Um, that's the one I prefer. So I've just been watching some original recipes to try and uh, get over you know whatever kind of funk I may have. Mm. Um, it could just be the mental anguish of like trying to walk again, um, you know, and, uh, and just how trying to figure out how life is different, you know, because the thing about the healing process is when it first starts, it hurts and you think, oh, life will never be the same. And then after about a week and a half, you realize, oh wait, that stopped hurting. So, (laughs) you know, I'm now (laughs) in a new wave of that where I am. Uh, walking in both sneakers around the house with a crutch. So, okay. yeah. So we are, okay. yeah. Now the tread, we're trying to even out that tread. Uh, yeah, <laughs> baby. There's been one sneaker I've been using the whole time and it's mate has been in the closet just like, what about me? And I'm like, <laughs> hopefully we get to you soon. Your time so, is coming. Yeah. So we're getting there, but it's a new set of aches and pains. Yeah, and uh, cool. And so I am, It's just like the bummer of trying to figure all of that out. That could be why I am uh, just a little down. My spirits are a little down. And again, I maybe I just need your magical salad. I don't know. (laughs) It's out there. I'll I'll, I'll bring it over. Real talk. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) You know, there's no like uh, there's no like uh, group hangout like apps for like. People recovering from like you know broken bones and ankles and stuff. That'd be no. like a cool dating app, you know. Like, no, like oh app. lord, no, none of us can do anything. <laughs> but you could not do stuff together. Yeah, I'm good not doing stuff alone. <laughs> yeah, that be fire. No, that it's sounds. Like four places accommodating the four crutches at a time. Well, you know? that's here's the thing. Um, I was talking to my roommate about this last night about um the different ways to view uh like broken bones and healing from them and either you're you're someone who's like uh oh my goodness this will take forever like i don't know if i can bounce back from this quickly this hurts or yeah. there's the as my, as my roommate called it the um extreme sports version of it where they're just like adds the cost of living because they're throwing themselves around all the time. Yeah. And, uh, and you know, they're just like, it, it, like you see people talk about breaking a bone and they're just like, man, and I was back at it and you know, in no time. <laughs> and, and it's like, really? Huh? Cause it seems like that takes a while. And that's not just a thing that's like young versus old. Cause you could be right. a young person and break a bone and be like, I'll never move again. You know what I mean? It's more of a, a mindset. And yeah. so, uh, my roommate, uh, again, he broke his collarbone last spring and he is, he, we were talking about our reluctance to kind of, you know, move through it and, and that kind of thing. And okay. he's just like, you know, I mean, I, I broke the bone and I, you know, I, I feel a little scared about 
doing stuff again. And I was like, didn't you just go rock climbing yesterday? And he's like, yeah. <laughs> and I said, wasn't this the fourth time you've broken that collarbone? And he's like, mm. third or fourth time. I can't remember because of the concussions. And I'm like, okay, you are the extreme sports guy. <laughs> you've always been, you, you have drove, you, you, you fell while skating. Yeah. And got and was like, oh, I think my arm's broken. And then got back in your car and then just drove hours home <laughs> to a, like, <laughs> you're the extreme sports guy. Yeah. You can't help me. I'm always scared. I've yeah, always well, been me. scared. Yeah. yeah we, we, we different people. Yeah. So, <laughs> so I don't think we solved uh, anything. That's fair. <laughs> yeah. But, you know. Yeah, I- you know, you're right. Like, I can't picture, like, uh, like I don't think Sean White or, like, Tony Hawk are slowing down. Like, phys- no. like they're moving slower, but they're still doing yes, all the exactly. things. Yes, exactly. All you the know things. What I mean? Like, Tony Hawk is probably, I don't know how old he is. He's a, a few years older than I am, right? Right. And he looks he's, older. Right, but because he's beaten up, but he's still out there, like, right. in spirit. He's still skateboarding. Like, he's still like, yeah, oh, well, I'll get up there today. Yeah. I mean, here's the thing is that him slowing down is still him moving a lot. <laughs> he's yeah, 55. So he's like, yeah, he's he's like four years older than I am. Yeah. So, yeah, like he's not, he's him. Yeah. He still is doing whatever loop-de-loops that he's doing. I don't want to remember what the numbers are for the amounts of whatever um you know but yeah he can still do that because that's what his body does yeah even in discomfort that's what his body does and i don't i am curious to see what my body does when it's back to as close to being back to like yeah okay like i'm like huh what's my activity still curling (laughs) up in the fetal position (laughs) yo yo real talk shot yo Mm -hmm. i know you won't say yes to this uh-oh. But I would love, love to, like, sign up for parkour classes with you. You have got to be out of your mind. Real I will you. I will drive you to a parkour class. Where are you going to parkour? <laughs> Boy, if you don't stop. No. You can start low level first. You know, What is low level? Like- low level is tripping over your own feet, and I already stand did up. that. But we stand up, you know? <laughs> no. We, stand uh-uh. up. we roll. No. You know? <laughs> I don't think I Hold can. On, dude, that's just so bad with you, yo. Park <laughs> no. uh, how about we just let's take a tap dancing class instead <laughs> so i can't use that in real life you'd be surprised it's my yeah. tap dancing that helps me balance on one leg while i had another leg that was yeah oh okay tap dancing is mostly weight distribution on right. the balls of your feet so I'm desperate to get back on the ball of my right foot, which is the bum one, so that I can kind of, yeah, so that you're kind of ready for everything. You're always in a slight crouch, knees softly bent on like, not your tippy toes, but just like ready for whatever, because you might have to, right? Right. Oh, yeah. So... (laughs) So Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. So that is, it turns out that helped me balance. Huh. Uh, because you're also like balancing on one foot while doing stuff with the other foot. So uh, it, it, it turned out great because I could always do stuff with my right foot, but balance on my left. And luckily that's how this worked out. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, but it's still, you know, it's still a lot. <laughs> okay. We we could do one in one. Okay. We do one day we tap dance, one day we parkour. I, why parkour? I, yeah, I just want to be like mobile and like I want to do like cartwheels and rollouts over okay. like park benches. I want to be able to get away from the cops when I'm 65. Sure, sure. You know, um, quick question: Have you ever been able to do a cartwheel? I do one every year. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's every year. Right, you do one. Make it a point. Yes. Okay, I've never done a cartwheel before. See, come on, Sha. It's our time. Uh, it is too late. It's <laughs> too late. Like- so I've taught so many people. We could do this. I don't think. Do you understand? I broke my ankle trying to carry in bottles of water <laughs> and slipped on cardboard. I'm not. I'm not doing a cartwheel. I don't do anything where I feel the wind move against my face. 
I don't do oh, it. Man. I don't do it. The most of it is if the window is rolled down in a car. Otherwise, nah. I'm not in convertibles. I'm not in go karts. I'm not on skates. I'm not on bikes. <laughs> Yo. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 So me flipping is wild. <laughs> Tripping, I can trip all day, not okay. trip over my feet, just like ah, I'm tripping, but I'm not flipping. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh man, I was rooting for I thought it'd be dope. Yeah. It'd be like the full spectrum comeback story, you know? Shot broke her ankle, she came back better than ever, you know. Uh, I gotta now find that over rooftops. I gotta know? find a different way to have a coming back better than ever uh situation. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, but I, I don't think that's going to be it because you're not going to have anything to compare it to. You understand? Okay. Like there, there will not be any footage or photos of me mid cartwheel or <laughs> a fourth of the way through a parkour to like, right, here's right. how she used to, you don't have that all. Any picture of me is of me barely smiling, sitting in the corner somewhere. Those are all the pictures of me. So Really, let's shoot for me giving a full smile. That's really, okay, okay. that's the stretch. <laughs> full smile, 2024. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's that's, awesome. that's what we're shooting for. That's what we're shooting for. Oh, man. Temper expectations. Okay? Yes. Yeah. That's, that is actually what's on my coat of arms. <laughs> Temper expectations. Oh, my goodness. I love this. <laughs> I, I uh yeah I guess uh I guess that's accurate I should I should uh I should do that more often I, that might be uh the thing I think I struggle with most I don't I don't temper expectations much at all you know? <laughs> yeah no uh, you go for the top <laughs> all the time and then you tend to be a little surprised when uh <laughs> folks aren't up there with you or willing to go and uh I sometimes have to say what made you think. <laughs> no, like, think about the people and each time to your credit you think for a uh, like a second or two and you're like nah you're right so yeah yeah I'm, you I'm, see it you i'm you, open-minded you know what i mean yeah. if nothing else i feel you, like that's a uh, key to life if you want to mm -hmm. do crazy ideas you got to be willing to accept the smart people around you when they tell you <laughs> nah b <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Let's yeah. get into the news. <laughs> okay. I, so you I, added an article here, right? You I added the first one, yeah. Let's do it. Okay. You want me to read this? Please, go for it. Okay. This is from uh, WSB uh, Atlanta, Channel 2. Uh, ATL. That's, yep. Uh, from Hall County, uh, Margaritaville at Lake Lanier Islands is taking the first steps in building the state's first water slide coaster which will open as part of its new Fins Up Water Park this summer. The okay. water park held a ceremony last Wednesday to welcome breaking ground on the new ride. Officials announced that they got to sign some steel on the apocalyp <laughs> Apocalypso. Whoa. Which will be the centerpiece of a tower with four new slides. This monumental investment marks the most significant expansion of Margaritaville at Lanier Islands in decades, adding Georgia's largest Water, water slide complex to the water park, boasting an impressive 15 slides in total in 2024, park officials wrote. The ride will have the largest, quote, blasterango drop, okay. end quote, in the U.S., which sends up and downhill at an average speed of 30 miles per hour. Three more slides will lead from the same tower, the Serpentine Storm, the Dreamsicle Dive, and the Mango Mania, which is meant for younger riders. Um, the, the Tower of Slides featuring Georgia's first water, water slide coaster will be an epic addition to Margaritaville at Lanier Island, said Bucky Perry, vice president of Margaritaville at Lanier <laughs> Islands. For those seeking an escape and a nonstop day of high-speed intensity thrills and family fun, Margaritaville at Lanier Islands is the place to be. The park's set to open on May 4th. I just want to repeat that last sentence one more time. <laughs> For those seeking an escape in a nonstop day of high-speed intensity thrills and family mm -hmm. fun, Margaritaville <laughs> at Lanier <laughs> Islands is the place to be. 
Oh, man, I love this. Uh, says Bucky Perry, <laughs> vice president of Margaritaville at Lanier Islands. My man, Bucky Perry, yo. Okay, so we got a couple. Of, I, I, I really just want to hit on two things. Um, one, I believe people are moving to Atlanta for the city. It's just kind of known for its innovation, right? Mm, okay. Uh, because as we see here, they keep finding new ways to kill people at Lake Lanier. <laughs> a water slide coaster? Like a high speed water slide. Yup. At Lake Lanier, <laughs> <laughs> where folks are dying easy. No effort. <laughs> no effort. <laughs> We're going to add a challenge. <laughs> Life is running on easy there. Y'all still dying on okay. your own. <laughs> Okay. You don't need to go to level pro yet, okay? F fantastic. And this, again, is the lake that was made, a man-made lake, where they cleared out a whole uh, black community and mm. filled, it, filled it in to make Lake Lanier. And uh, I, I want to say um, the ancestors are mad and constantly taking bodies. Um, as they should be. As they should be. So the brain trust at Margaritaville mm -hmm. at Lanier Islands thought, what if we made this happen faster? <laughs> okay. Well, and they're second, not dying enough for easy. Not, yeah, yeah. All yeah. All There's too many people are moving here. So let's thin <laughs> out the ranks. We got to, we're moving here too quickly. Um, secondly, uh, what are your views on water parks and water slides? Have you ever really been to one? And I'm not big on water fun. <laughs> yeah, like <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't do it. Uh, okay. I went to this whole Mexico thing with my boy for his birthday. Uh, I didn't do the pool. I, 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 I don't rock with all of that. Like it just seems weird. I don't want to see this many nipples. Uh, like I don't want to see all my boys' chests. It's, it's, it's too much information. You're like, I love y'all. Oh, wow. Your skirt's on. I don't want to see that. I don't want to acknowledge that, like, there's more skin on any of my friends. Um, Let alone strangers. Yeah, that's just wild. Like, that's too much information. I don't know you as a person. Why do I know your belly button shape? Like, that's crazy to me. I, uh, I, don't, I don't know you. I don't want to know that. Too much information. Oh, that a water park or any water fund is too much information. Is so funny. I literally can't laugh. <laughs> Yo, that uh, my whole my body is stuck with a full body. <laughs> I can't even let out because it, that's such a beautiful way of putting that. Yo, it, it messes my like. It's the only time in my life where like I don't know how to make eye contact to a man when we're talking. <laughs> like, <laughs> like what? Where am I supposed to look at you, my G? There's so <laughs> many other points of contact. That, <laughs> like, why are we like this together? <laughs> no, there's no reason, B. There's so many other places we could talk. So many other places, yo. We should have shirts on for this conversation. It's too casual. <laughs> it's crazy. What do you do for a living? I don't care. Put a shirt on, my G. <laughs> we <can> talk. <laughs> so don't talk to me over here. It's crazy, yo. <laughs> I can't do that place, yo. None of these places. Every time Gabby want to go to a water park, I pay for it. Her and the kids could go. I don't want to be around people like that. It's just weird to me, yo. I don't want to be around people like that. <laughs> that shit is off. Like, oh, I can't do wow. it. Oh, uh -uh. man. Well, that, honestly, that's better than I could ever hope for. Um, <laughs> I uh, I just want you to know, this was sent to me um, by, hold on, who sent this to me? Um, Black Lady Blue on Twitter. Mm. Uh, old school old school fan troop and correspondent love it, love it. and she sent it and she was just like, please talk about this on the show so we can learn how Gastor feels about water slides. <laughs> and I thought, <laughs> I thought, Oh, this is great because it's Lanier, it's Lake Lanier. So I certainly have something to say, which is what the fuck are y'all doing? <laughs> and I honestly do kind of want to know how Gastor feels about water slides. And you did not disappoint my man. <laughs> 
That shit bothered that me. Is... I've never never enjoyed it. Uh-uh. <laughs> it shit's weird, B. <laughs> and like, the, like I, it's trauma from like being a kid. Cause like when you're young, I'm already looking up at people. So like when you got your shirt <laughs> off, I'm eye level to belly buttons. It's just weird. I don't want to see this, B. Okay. I'm seeing hair on your stomach and like <laughs> none of it. Like I don't respect you anymore. You know, wow. why are we talking, B? Nah, wow. man, you can't tell me what to do. I so, see what this looks like. <laughs> okay, you know all right. I mean? So that's how the child you viewed it. Okay. Straight up. Well, this is just weird, B. Like, I don't need this information, you know? Nah, man. Uh-uh. It wow. revealed too much. So do you swim at all? I can, but, like, I, I, I took classes when I was real young. Like, my dad made me. Mm -hmm. uh, I was really fast, like, uh... Like they was trying to get me to do like the like the local like tryout team, um, like they wanted me to like train with people that like did it for like high school as a right. sport and college and all of that shit. So I was like real fast, but like I went and swim with other people. I was like, nah, B, I'm not doing this like class <laughs> shit. I'm not. This isn't fun. I'm doing this because you made me as a survival trait. I could do it. You want right. to do a training class where like it's me and the coach? I'll swim by myself. Okay. And like if a kid of mine is drowning, I'm capable. Like I'll go get them. But right. like I'm not like just swimming for kicks with hundreds of people. That's just insane. Okay, what are, Why, what are we doing here? Kicks with what? <laughs> <laughs> like beaches as a whole concept just fucks my head up. I don't get it. <laughs> None of it makes sense to me at all. <laughs> I, I can't I don't understand it. As a every time people try to break it down, every part of the beach sounds horrible to me. No, I'm seeing I mean, all of my friends with no shirts on. They yeah. sand on my food. I got to get clean to get dirty to get clean to get dirty. <laughs> it's insanity. <laughs> like, none of it makes sense. You know what I mean? Oh, you thirsty? We got to drag this fucking 30-pound container <laughs> onto the beach to get drinks. There's drinks at home. It's hot over there, too. I could stand outside and get warm and get a tan. None of oh, it. Like it, okay. Every step of it bothers me. I don't get it. I don't like it. I don't like none of these sports. I'm like, real, hey, Gabby, you know, I'm reaffirming my stance. I ain't moving to none of these hot places. I refuse <laughs> okay, to. Okay, I'm real sorry. Talk. Gab it's off Gabby, the table. Don't listen to him. Don't listen <laughs> to him. He absolutely will. Y'all will be I on the beaches of North Carolina again. Don't listen to him. That don't shit be hurting me, yo. <laughs> <laughs> I show okay. you pictures. The whole trip of North Carolina, we on the beach. I am in this shirt. Like, straight up. <laughs> I'm on the beach, fully covered. The kids was out there having the time of their life going swimming three, four times a day. I mm -hmm. would go out and I would stand on the wooden platform and I oh, would yell security? out, yo, straight up. I'm like, yo, y'all good? Y'all good? Got any sandwiches? <laughs> nah, I'll be inside, you know? And I went back in and I sat on my porch where I could see the beach from 100 feet away. You know what I mean? Enjoying mm -hmm. the sounds. That's beautiful. Real talk. Okay. All right. But like on the beach... Like with nah, B. Uh uh. <laughs> Keep all that. <laughs> Real I want none of that. <laughs> That's the only reason North, North Carolina beats the only reason it made sense because it was private. I saw three, four chests at a time all day. <laughs> okay. Real all talk. right. I could like I could I could pace myself. Like, all right, every like two to three hours, I'm gonna see too much, but it's okay. You okay. I mean? They're allowed. If, it's America. What if you had access to a uh, like a pool where you could swim by yourself. Would you go like today by yourself? No one else. Yeah, I could do that. I could do you that. Could, okay, you could you could swim by yourself somewhere. Yeah, I could okay. swim by myself, and I could swim with my family. Okay, like me, and I don't even want like my parents no more. No, like, no, your even, immediate family. Immediate family. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to see my dad like that. I don't want to see my mom like that. I want to <laughs> see my siblings. Nah, B. I'll let you use the pool too. Tell me when you're done. Let's 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 go out. Okay, but like. Don't nah, but you coming over to swim? Cool, I'll be downstairs. Do what you got to do. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> Yo, this is all nah. very important information to have. <laughs> when you finally move from New York, this is very key. I, I want you to already have this down in writing, so this isn't Yo. a surprise to anyone. <laughs> that, I'm, I promise you, Gabby knows. We, we talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I'm sure. She's like, "Yo, we gotta have a pool," because she's like, oh, "Like," and I, I, I appreciate it. She's like, "Uh." You know, we got kids that, you know, my son turns 14 next week, my daughter 15. So we're like already thinking like our next home might be our forever home. Right. So she's, we should have a pool. So like, we you know, when our, our, my siblings come over, when our kids come over, they could like, they want to stay longer, or like be with Tia, Tia or the, our, 
or like eventually our uh, when we're the grandparents, you know? Right, right. And I'm like, that's cool, but like, I just, I just know I'm not gonna be outside with them like at all. <laughs> like, that's just not the part because like I don't want to do that to someone else now. Like now sure. I'm the, the weird dude with the no shirt on. Right. And then, like, you know, I'm going to make a weird memory for my niece and nephew. You know what I mean? Okay. Well, I it's mean, cool. it doesn't have they, to They love me. Way. They see me as Coco G, you know? And I don't I don't want to, like, have that out there. Yo, Coco G got, like, a weird, like, like his left nipple load and his right. Why he got <laughs> hair there? You know? And, like, now they don't listen to me. Like, you know? And nah. Uh-uh. Okay. It's not happening. Oh, it not man. be me. I am so glad we covered that. <laughs> I can't tell you how happy I am. That uh-uh. we got to the bottom of that. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, Lord of mercy! Will not have. Well, that was next- just the first story. So, <laughs> well, yeah. whatever else is gravy at this point. I think we we truly got to the bottom of something here. Let's block out that trauma. Uh- <laughs> <laughs> In other news, a uh, uh, woman uh, used uh, rewards card software glitch to steal $27,000 in gas over six months. Good for her. Respect. Yo, hell yeah. Nebraska woman exploited a software glitch to steal 27 G's worth of gas. Uh, She stole an estimated of 7,413 gallons over six months. Uh, The glitch allowed anyone swiping a reward card twice to pump gas for free. Yo. Nice. Hell yeah. How did she discover this? Uh, <laughs> the uh, Lincoln, Nebraska uh, was uh, the first to report that Dawn Thompson, uh, 45, was charged with uh, one count of theft by unlawful uh, taking uh, relating to the exploitation of the glitch. Uh, Thompson was arrested on March 6th following the investigation. Uh, police said that Thompson used the glitch to pump free gas over six months. Um, it was reported that the fuel cost between November 2022 and, t- and June 2023 was about 3.758 per gallon, equaling $27,860. Yo, I, I support I, all of this. Yeah, this is great. It didn't hurt an individual. It hurt this whatever company it was that had the rewards card or whatever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, great. Fantastic. Real talk. I'm all about this, yo. Real, <laughs> Free This her. ain't even like a... I wouldn't even call this... I'm mad they're calling this a theft. This would have been I a know. hustle. This, exactly. This, yeah. Now, this is a hustle. Like, Straight up. I hate how much they're saying she, you know, she stole and blah, blah. Nah, man. She took advantage <laughs> of an opportunity. Yeah. Real <laughs> talk. I don't see anything she did wrong. Like, no. Because, like, all of this is something, like, first of all, who didn't notice it? Like, mm. on their end, you should have been, like, paying attention. I'm consistently losing, like, money around, like, uh, these, these type of, like, credit card swipes. Like, like there should have been like a system in place where like I feel like uh I would assume gas stations can tell when there's a discrepancy when they've received a certain amount of money for a certain amount of gas. Right. So like but, if they're seeing that, okay. They so should it, be the ones to fix that. It says a loss prevention manager for Bosselman Enterprise, which owns the gas station, discovered that one card had been used repeatedly to get free gas. Um The card's information was traced back to her, who was also captured on video surveillance, pumping gas, pumping fuel into her car on several occasions. Um, The card was used over 500 times. And on some occasions, fuel was stolen several times in a single day. Another woman had also used the card and claimed that Thompson had allowed her to use it to get discounted fuel. The, (laughs) The local news outlet said that the glitch was fixed last June. So she got like a smooth seven, eight months. That's beautiful. Yeah, good for her. Real talk. She wasn't even telling, like, she wasn't selling the idea. Mm-mm. She was she was sharing with the community. Come on. Real, this is beautiful. We Gas need more was damn like near this. $4 a gallon. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. It is not her fault that y'all didn't know how to fix a glitch. Exactly. And I feel like if this is a glitch, you got to eat that. Like You, you got to eat that. Yeah. You got to eat that. That's all you. You made the mistake. She pointed it out for you. <laughs> well, you know what she, I mean? she, you know, I wouldn't say it was a direct, hey, you guys made a mistake. <laughs> or <laughs> more of just like a, oh, I guess y'all caught that mistake, huh? Well, okay. it was a good run. <laughs> <You know? laughs> Bro, 
Real talk. You got to let it keep that, man. I'm, I'm mad at all of this process, yo. Well, and I mean, like, it, it does say at the end, um, at the time of reporting, Thompson was not listed on the Lancaster County Department of Corrections inmate roster. So okay. she, I guess, was arrested, but she hadn't been, she's not in jail. So they're probably yeah, like, just like, yeah, I don't know, girl. <laughs> you got us. <laughs> yeah, because like, also, like the math of it is stupid, right? Like, that's significant money for her. Mm -hmm. But like, that's 27 hours of a lawyer. Right. Yes. Like, that, there's no way it makes sense for you to go after this lady. Like, and also, your computer programmer, I promise you, costs more than that. Like, right. yo, like, yep. every single solution that you could have came up with would have cost more than catching this lady and pointing it and having her pointed out. Yeah. She Just, did y'all a service. She did. She It took y'all seven months, but you figured it out and you found the glitch and you fixed it. Uh, I mean, just ban her from that gas station. Yeah. Just do that if you want to, if you really feel like you need to do something. And then she'll just go to another gas station. Real talk. Yeah. I would I would keep her forever. Like, unless you, uh, low key, you were loyal. You know, you kept coming <laughs> I mean back. Yeah, you're loyal when stuff is when you figured out the system when you're getting I mean, over. I don't know if loyal is the word you want to use. <laughs> I'm loyal to the ones I can steal from. You know, yeah. I, 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 that's a little different. But <laughs> also, like, what are you doing? Like, uh, twenty seven thousand dollars in gas in six months is wild. Yeah, but she was doing. I mean, she she was letting other people use it. Okay. Yeah. Because it said like sometimes multiple times a day. Yeah, that's, that's yeah, that's, that's absolutely that's just like her, you know, maybe a, a boyfriend or a spouse or something, maybe yeah. a kid, a coworker, uh, you know, someone in her knitting. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh man, yo, you, and you know, like them dudes played hot potato real quick now when them charges came up. They were pressing <laughs> you to use the card, but like now when they were like, "Yo, wh whose card is this?" No, oh, no, that was her. That was her. Oh, oh, she was making <laughs> right. me go. I mean, it all it all was on that particular card. So, mm. man, I'd be so tight, yo. I, I let you borrow the card. And you ain't taking none of this twenty seven k off of you. <laughs> no, <Come> on, B. <laughs> <laughs> you got to split these charges with me if you. Yeah, I promise I, you, people were pressing her. Like she was stressed about. She had to create a like she had to create a lending system over this shit. Oh yeah, no, there's definitely a spreadsheet. Straight like, up, yo. What are what are the days that you need gas? <laughs> uh, I will meet you at this corner. I mean, yeah, yeah. Did she like set up shop behind, like across the street from that gas station, <laughs> and then just kind of roll through, yeah. like like every three hours, just like boop 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 boop, just hit every machine. <laughs> Go on, everybody, get your free gas. Yo, she could pick people up at the gas station. Yeah, this gas on me. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> I got you. Oh, that good Live for happy. good for her. Real, I mean, real talk, y'all. I'm impressed. Yeah, I, I I hope they don't toss her in the slammer. But good for her. <laughs> seven seven thousand four hundred and thirteen. What? Huh? What are you doing? That's how many gallons, right? Oh Gallon. yeah. I'm, oh, I'm I guess curious. so. That's how many gallons she took, right? Good for her. I can't say it enough. Her. <laughs> 7,413. So let's say her car get like 22 miles to the gallon. Yo, she she got 163,000 miles worth of gas. I mean, that makes sense. She's in Nebraska. Nothing's Yo, close. Yeah. You need that. Like it that that seems like a lot, but I mean, there there's so much of the country you have to drive. A far, a far piece. You got to drive. So, yeah, absolutely. It probably isn't even that much in the grand scheme of things. Hey, I was going to say, you could drive across the United States, uh, 2742, uh, 2,472 miles. Oh, uh, okay. So, she could have drove across America 60 times with that free gas money, yo. Uh, it depends on the route. <laughs> 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 mm, but... Yeah, I mean, I'm so hyped with this hustle. Yeah, like it's you know, uh, it, it, I'm sure everybody who got the gas truly needed it. That seems yeah. like a lot. And if that's yeah. what it was in Nebraska, what was it in the rest of the like 
Yeah, absolutely. Yikes. Kudos, B. Real talk. You a real American hero. Yeah. I'm impressed with you. Uh, in other news, uh, New York license plate. Oh, we got a lot, another hustle. New York license plate cheats uh, skirted $108 million in speeding camera tickets last year. Uh, New York City lost an estimated $108 million last year from drivers who used fake or obscure license plates to evade speed cameras. Uh, Lander, uh, which uh, uh, comp controller Brad Lander um, said on Monday, the problem has proven to not only undermine the city's uh, speed and red light camera program, but also the technology used for toll collection by the MTA, Port Authority, and the State Thruway Authority. I mean, uh, the duh, that's the point. <laughs> the point is to undermine the speed and red light cameras and the toll collection. <laughs> the, uh, according to Landy's report, uh, 22% of the cars caught speeding by the city's automated cameras were rejected as unbillable in the first half of 2023 because of their plates uh, being unreadable. Uh, the majority of those had so-called ghost plates or temporary license plates printed off of the internet. The next most common reason speeding cars were deemed unbillable was because their license plates were defaced or covered up. Um, in uh, the data reported uh, to the news, the plate cheaters cost the MTA $46 million and the Port Authority $40 million in 2022. I mean, all right. Yeah, sure. Like, yeah, yeah I guess. Uh, I, I wonder if they just didn't, think of that when they implemented all these cameras and, and things. Yeah, you don't have real people, people no more. That people were going to put a like a little clear or a, like a pink colored piece of acetate or something over their license plate <laughs> that matches the car, you know, that goes with the, mm -hmm. the the style of the car, but then you can't really read the numbers. And and wait, New York, they have license plates on the front and the back right that's yep mandatory yeah so i mean you know then you got to mess up both of those or you got to get one of those uh uh license plates that you know follow me to waffle house or something i don't know whatever <laughs> it is that take up some of the space <laughs> i guess y'all don't really have those here but <laughs> <laughs> yeah sure that's not i mean i'm not surprised by that yeah i, I think i think this is uh I feel like this is a game again, a game of like catch me if you can. Yeah. Like, I mean I'm, you're saving money on not having staff there. Mm -hmm. Right? Most of us are gonna still follow the rule. Right. Like real talk. You're still gonna get the majority of the money without any real effort. And then, yeah, I'm okay with you having a, a cop there every now and then by surprise. They're like, if I if if uh, the thing goes off and says, Hey, that guy didn't pay, you got me. Yeah, here's the ticket money, you know? See right. if you give me tomorrow. You know, and we can play the game again. It's, it's, it's Tom and Jerry, real life. I mean, the thing is, um, my understanding is uh, to have a, a, a car in this city um, is to deal with tickets constantly, be yeah. it parking or speeding. So, you know what? If I want to throw, a, you know, some sort of thing, <laughs> a Hello Kitty design over my license plate so you can say oh, i guess just look at the front i don't know what to tell you <laughs> yeah, let me live it's, it's hard out here i'm trying to park i've been circling these blocks for <laughs> 45 minutes i've missed the first half of the movie now so Real talk. yeah i mean I you got know. so many ways of identifying my car right you know what i mean you got yeah. the front the license plate front and back you got i got stickers all over the front left side of my car mm -hmm. you got registration yep. if like you got too much information on me <laughs> you right. know what I mean? All right, right there. there. Yeah. It's You'll all there, it all over the place. Mm -hmm. And not not to mention, you literally take a picture of the front of the car whenever this stuff happens. You see me in the car. That's you true. Gotta, like, I'm in the picture. Like, there's That's so true. many things already. There's so Yeah, so just use one of those, I guess. Yeah. You can't find me. You got my ID. You got you got you got all the IDs. You can match it to the picture. <laughs> all right. Or you got maybe all the just, cars. Maybe just, you know what? Just let it go. Yeah, let it rock. If you can't it figure rock. it out with all that info, let it rock. I mean, if you weren't there in the moment, <laughs> then I guess it happened and, and we're all still okay. Until That's you, it. <laughs> you keep it moving. Keep yeah, just just let it go. Just let it, why Let's you talk. talk? Why you always bringing up old shit? <laughs> <laughs> huh? Police? Why you always talking about what happened? <laughs> 
Only time Shalewa is toxic in a relationship. <laughs> in a relationship with the city. <laughs> in other news, uh, Massachusetts Library will let you pay late fees with cat pictures. That's right. Uh, who? It's March Meowness. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, who would uh, think that one day you could uh, use a cat picture as currency? Well, in an effort to encourage library use, the uh, War uh, Worcester? Uh, Worcester? No, I'm sure it's just wor Worcher. <laughs> Worcher? <laughs> I'm sure it's just like Worcester or something like that, because all of those all those New England uh, names are like they have all these extra letters. And then when you say it, it's just like murmur and that's it. So Worcester Public yes. Library mm -hmm. in Massachusetts is accepting photos of cats as payments for outstanding fines on lost or damaged library materials throughout this month. Uh, library uh, officials say a significant number of young patrons have accumulated fees since the start of the pandemic, and they hope the cat photo program will incentivize their return. Uh, even if you don't have a cat in your life, you can still draw one. Jesus, they're desperate for books. Uh, <laughs> Wait, yeah. hold on. <laughs> Jeez, <laughs> hold on. You're going hard on them. <laughs> Jeez, these idiots. <laughs> you say it like that. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm picturing empty-ass libraries over there like, yo, I don't think that's it. I don't. I don't think. I don't think the cupboards are bare. I, <laughs> we need these book bags, please. please. You know what I mean? These and we don't poops don't know how to hold on to a book. <laughs> Ask it for anything. <laughs> Just come in and spell the word cat, and we'll take your book back. No, no questions. <laughs> Oh, man, this is terrible, me. Well, I think it's just <laughs> that thing of, like, when you rented out whatever and, you know, <laughs> it's going to cost a little something to bring it back. You know, there's going to be a late fee. And you're like, oh, I got to pay that late fee. Or oh, I'll just do that, like, next week. I I'll just, I'll put up, okay, I'll do it tomorrow. And you just keep putting it off and putting off till it's a point where you're like, Oh no, if I go, they're going to arrest me. They are not mm. going to arrest you. <laughs> but it feels like it. You feel yeah. guilty and you feel just like, oh gosh, I can't even walk by, I can't drive by any library anymore. You know, like you just feel <laughs> bad. And I think this is just them going, hey man, just draw a cat and bring the <laughs> stuff back and we're good. You know, like it's not that crucial. <laughs> But they're, oh, I don't think they're just like, we have nothing to rent to anyone. I don't <laughs> think they're whole, there are still encyclopedias. No one's taking home <laughs> reference books like that. We I got think. eight books in microfiche. We need <laughs> these books. <laughs> Please. Yeah, I don't think it's that bad. I don't think it's that bad. <laughs> That's very funny. You know? <laughs> You're like, these dummies. <laughs> uh. Oh, man. That's awesome, B. <laughs> Finally, we have uh, spring breaks. Hottest shot. A bartender serves a drink along with a slap to the face. Hmm. That's right. Uh, spring breakers in uh, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, are cramming into a local bar for shots to slaps. Um, but it's not for a bar fight. Ha ha ha. New York Post really got trash comedy writers, yo. They're uh, the worst and they think they're the best. Real <laughs> so, yo. They are so proud of everything they do. <laughs> and it's all so horrible. <laughs> uh, bartender uh, Ayana Callas, uh, 26, uh, serves her signature hurricane shots at the backyard Fort Lauderdale uh, for $30 every night for the uh, popular party season. Um, the specialty shots is a full performance though. Uh, she, uh, uh, spring breakers, uh, revealers that spring break revealers, uh, take shots. Uh, oh, revelers, pardon me. Spring break revelers take a shot from a glass held in Callis's mouth before getting a pitcher of water poured on their head and a slap to the face. Oh my God. Stop Jeez. it. Get a dom. <laughs> now I'm like, get, get out of here. <laughs> what are you doing? You are taking up space and you're making it slippery in there. Fucking get a dominatrix and take care of that shit off site. <laughs> I did not travel all the way to Fort Lauderdale to get fucked up with you getting slapped around. Take it to the parking lot, my man. Get out of here. 
Yo, imagine if that's how you broke your ankle, Sha. What? I mean, people be like, yo, what happened? Yo, some fucking dude would have <laughs> shot next to me. That would be more shocking because they'd be like, what were you doing at a bar? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let's let's talk about the slap later. Sha, you was at a bar? Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Oh my goodness! That's right. They get a full uh, pitcher of water thrown on them. Then they get slapped in the face. Um, she wants to uh, let us know that she uh, always insists on consent first um, <laughs> before slapping somebody. And she is a performer, um, so uh, she's making it look really good. Like she's slapping them as hard. She's making it look like she's slapping them as hard as she can, but not actually slapping them as hard as she can. Uh, prices vary depending on the alcohol and the intensity of the routine. Uh, she estimates that she sells between 150 and 200 shots a night. Yo, these people are getting rocked in the face. Oh, man. That's wild, yo. No, I, can't. I, I just saw the next sentence, and it says, the bartender didn't invent the hurricane shot, but the fit server has put her own spin on the experience with her acrobatic moves and wrestling-style theatrics as her alter ego, Hurricane I- Ayana. Which, <laughs> now, when I'm thinking, okay, wrestling, all right. Yeah. This, you got to be careful because, you know, some idiot is going to be like, wait a minute, that hurt. And now you've got security having to walk you to your car or some shit. You know what I mm-hmm. mean? Because, yeah. yeah, there's that. But, like, I, as long as there's the same kind of security as there is at a strip club, not yeah. to say that what she's doing is the same as doing, but a strip club is performance. And right. that is, I feel like sometimes people... Uh, forget that part. Um, it mm. is, you know, you pay for the performance, yes, but you don't then get to. Uh, if you didn't like the performance, you don't you you don't get to chase them down afterwards, or That's try right. to hit them in it. You know what I mean? Leave so, it Yeah, I I hope that this is safe for her, but like, what a ridiculous thing. Hey, if you would like, ugh. To have me and Shalewa slap you for six thousand dollars, <laughs> no Yo, problem. Absolutely. Yo, you know the email. <laughs> 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 we give you two for one. We each yeah. slap. Yeah. Okay? Now those are messages I want to see in my <laughs> in my inboxes. All you gotta do is like and subscribe to the show, baby. You're an Apple, Spotify listener. We appreciate your ratings. Four stars. You never been slapped by either one of us. Uh, admittedly, that's okay. I get it. You know. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I, I can't think of too many people I've slapped. Yeah. I, uh, I still remember Valerie High School. I slapped the shit out of him. You know oh, I mean? okay. Came a whole right. thing. Uh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> People talk about it. I put it in the rap song afterward. And I, oh, and I wow. did the rap song in the talent show. It was a whole what? thing. Straight oh. up. It was crazy. Oh, my. You're, what? <laughs> Five stars. You were there when I slapped Valerie. <laughs> Real talk. You know, my slap game is crazy. Yeah, Legend. I mean it's it's been put into song. Real talk. I slapped him into working at Foot Locker for 15 years, you know? What? Changed his whole trajectory, his whole career. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Um, I don't yeah, so there are levels to the slap thing. If you need somebody to slap you into a new realization of life, I guess that would be Gastor. But if you need someone to just kind of Wake your ass up and and ask yourself, what am I doing right now in this moment? Uh, I'll I'll take care of that. <laughs> there you go for you That's- to for you to be like, whoa, okay, wait, I, I I'm going the wrong way. I will <laughs> let you. I will let you know if you're going the wrong way. Gaston will let you know if you got off if you're in the wrong place. Real talk. Yeah. Real talk. <laughs> I, 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 we ain't cool, but like I've heard from people, he like, yeah, nah, he was gonna do some crazy shit for his career. But, like, he just realized I like sneakers, you know? <laughs> and, like, that dude's trying to be a rapper. I changed all of that for that young man. You oh, know? my gosh. You're welcome. Wherever you are in Valley no, Stream or something, don't, you know? I don't, I don't know if you should. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I, I, as your counsel, Gastor, as your counsel, I am recommending that you <laughs> say nothing else. Uh, you have he, any heart? <laughs> he pleads the fifth. Troops and correspondence. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, and five. All of them. <laughs> you know? <laughs> you have oh. any articles you want us to cover, uh, please DM us directly on Twitter and Instagram at Silky Jumbo at Gas Ramonte. Uh, shout outs this week to uh, Dana Ford, uh, Shannon Lemoyne, Lori McDaniel, FCVLJ, and uh, Black Girl Blue, right? Uh, all, all one of us. Who else was it? 
Oh, yeah, Black Lady Blue. Black Lady Blue as well. Uh, Twitter works, as you see. We out here. We check all the articles. Yeah. <laughs> bang, bang. You know what I mean? This has been uh, admit a cathartic episode. For me. <laughs> yeah, we, yeah, you, you know? really got it out. <laughs> you got it out. <laughs> <laughs> for, for, my name is Gats Rabonte with, you know, my lawyer slash spiritual advisor, <laughs> Shalewa Shaw. Yeah. <laughs> we'll catch y'all next time. Peace. <laughs>